Can you give me a very basic definition of what NVIDIA is? Well, we are a technology company that uh, processes software for applications and domains of science that are barely possible without us. You people should be thanking Christ that I am who and what I am because you need me. You need me to save you. You do. I am the only one who possibly can. AI is not gonna take your jobs. The person who uses AI is gonna take your job. Do you guys agree with that? Okay, so use AI as fast as you can so that you could stay gainfully employed. NVIDIA has been a game changer in technology, leading in both gaming graphics and AI hardware. But why is everyone questioning its future? Isn't NVIDIA a tech giant? Isn't its leadership in AI and GPUs enough to secure its position at the top of the industry for years to come? Well, when you dig into the details, the situation isn't as straightforward as it seems. Despite its achievements, there are growing concerns about whether NVIDIA can maintain its dominance in a rapidly evolving market. We need to talk about NVIDIA's future. I'm going to break this down into five crucial pieces. And by the end, you'll have a clear understanding of whether NVIDIA is on the brink of a decline or poised for continued success, starting with the hype surrounding the stock. NVIDIA's meteoric rise is a story of innovation and timing, largely driven by its leadership in AI, a field which is expected to add about $15.7 trillion to the global economy by 2020. 30. This rapid growth reflects not only NVIDIA's strong position in the market, but also the broader excitement surrounding AI. However, with NVIDIA's price-to-earning ratio or PE ratio climbing above 90 in 2023, there is a growing concern that the stock might be overvalued, inflated by investor enthusiasm rather than solid fundamentals. To put that into context, let's consider what happened during the dot-com bubble. Companies with sky-high valuations eventually saw their stock plummet when reality set in. Cisco, once valued at over $500 billion, lost more than 80% of its value when the bubble burst. Could NVIDIA be following a similar trajectory? This is the first piece of the puzzle. Understanding whether NVIDIA's stock price is grounded in reality or floating on pure high. NVIDIA's dominance in AI-specific graphics processing unit, or GPUs for short, is nothing short of impressive controlling about 80% of the market by 2023. This dominance, however, is under constant threat. Just as Intel once ruled the CPU market before being challenged by AMD and ARM holdings, NVIDIA now faces its own set of challenges. Take AMD's MI300 series or Intel's Gaudi 2 chips, for example. These competitors offer similar or even better performance at lower costs, making them attractive alternatives for businesses looking to optimize their spending. Additionally, tech giants like Google Amazon and Microsoft are not just customers, they are even potential rivals. These companies are developing their own AI chips like Google's tensor processing units or TPUs and Amazon's gravitation processors which could reduce their dependence on Nvidia. If these giants continue down this path, Nvidia's share of the AI hardware market could shrink significantly. Another point is the rise of application-specific integrated circuits or ASICs for short. And this adds another layer of complexity. ASICs are designed to perform specific tasks more efficiently than general purpose GPUs. Companies like Google have already made significant strides with their TPUs, and Tesla has even developed its own AI chips for self driving cars. As ACICs gain popularity, particularly in specialized AI applications, the demand for Nvidia's GPUs could decrease threatening their dominance. We often call AI as the next industrial revolution, with the potential to reshape industries and economies. McKinsey estimates that AI could add $13 trillion to the global economy by 2030, and NVIDIA is well positioned to benefit from this growth. However, as with any revolution, there are winners and losers. For NVIDIA, being at the forefront of AI brings significant opportunities, but also considerable risks. Rapid advancements in AI could disrupt NVIDIA's customer base as new players enter the market. Additionally, as AI technologies become more pervasive, governments are likely to impose stricter regulations. The European Union's AI Act, for example, is one such regulatory measure that could affect NVIDIA's operations in Europe. These regulations could slow NVIDIA's growth or even increase its costs, potentially impacting the profit. 
profitability. Furthermore, Nvidia's GPUs are known for their high energy consumption. As the world becomes more conscious of climate change, governments might target energy intensive technologies with new regulations. This could force Nvidia to redesign its products to be more energy efficient, potentially increasing their production cost and reducing their performance. In a market where every fraction of performance counts, this could be a significant disadvantage for Nvidia. Nvidia's journey in AI is reminiscent of Cisco's experience during the dot-com boom. Back then, Cisco was valued at over $500 billion, but when the bubble burst, it lost more than 80% of its value. Nvidia's market cap crossed $1 trillion in 2023, raising concerns that it might be overvalued just like Cisco once was. Adding to these concerns, Nvidia's heavy reliance on Taiwan Semiconductor or TSMC for chip production could add further fuel to the fire. TSMC's strategic location in Taiwan makes Nvidia vulnerable to geopolitical tensions between the US and China. The semiconductor shortage that began in 2020 highlighted the fragility of the global supply chains with delays and increased costs potentially impacting industries worldwide. If a similar disruption occurs again, Nvidia's ability to meet demand and maintain its competitive edge could be severely compromised. Another emerging threat is quantum computing. While still in infancy, quantum computing could revolutionize the tech landscape as we know it, rendering the traditional GPUs, including those made by Nvidia, completely obsolete. Companies like IBM and Google are investing heavily in quantum computing, and if they succeed, the entire market could shift away from Nvidia's core products. Nvidia's competitive landscape is becoming increasingly crowded. It's not just the traditional rivals like AMD and Intel. New players like Cerebras Systems and GraphCore are making waves in the AI chip market. Cerebras' wafer scale engine, the world's largest chip designed specifically for AI tasks, can process enormous amounts of data much faster than traditional GPUs. Meanwhile, GraphCore's Intelligence Processing Unit, or IPU, offers a new approach to AI processing, optimized for machine learning tasks. These innovations could challenge Nvidia's dominance, particularly in cutting-edge AI applications. Nvidia's growth is closely tied to major customers like AWS, Google Cloud, and Microsoft Azure. These companies are developing their own custom chips, reducing their reliance on Nvidia. This trend could push other large companies to explore their own solution, further eroding NVIDIA's market position. The rise of open source AI platforms and new chip architecture could also chip away at NVIDIA's market share, especially if they offer similar performances at lower costs. To navigate these challenges, NVIDIA needs to continue innovating and expanding into new markets. The company's acquisition of Mellanox in 2020 for $6.9 billion was a strategic move that enhanced capabilities in high-performance computing and data centers. However, integrating new technologies and talent can be difficult. Past tech mergers like HP's troubled acquisition of autonomy serves as a cautionary tale of how even the most promising deals can somehow go wrong. As we piece together all these elements, it's clear that while NVIDIA is a major player in AI and GPU markets, it faces significant challenges ahead. From the risk of overvaluation and supply chain vulnerabilities to emerging competitors and potential regulatory hurdles, NVIDIA's future is far from guaranteed. However, NVIDIA's ability to innovate, adapt, and lead has bought it this far. The company's success will depend on how well it can navigate these challenges while maintaining its leadership in AI. The rise of new competitors, advancements in alternative technologies, and potential regulatory challenges all add complexity to NVIDIA's journey. As we ask, is this the end of NVIDIA? It's clear that the answer is far from simple. By addressing these risks directly and staying ahead of competition, NVIDIA can continue to thrive, but the road ahead is fraught with challenges, and only time will tell if NVIDIA Nvidia can maintain its dominance in the highly competitive and rapidly changing market of the semiconductor industry.